All right, now her her advantage here. She is a psychological ninja. We already talked about how they grow up with their slumber parties and their communication and talking about boys and they you you better bet from when, when a girl's um is young as like I said when we're playing Halo, women are asking secrets about men. How do you get your guy to do this? How do you get guys to do this? How do, remember they're very rational about love and relationships. They know a lot. So part of this magic of women is that men operate off the wrong assumption that women will never make sense to us. And so we'll never be able to figure them out. How, how many guys do you know that have a girlfriend or a wife and they have given up on trying to understand her? <laughs> hey, I don't know, man. I don't know. I have no idea. Happy wife, happy life. Every single one. Yep, Michael, every single one. Oh, I, I don't know. I just I just do what she says, and then uh, that way we don't get in a fight. That's how most guys operate, okay? But that is exactly what women want you to operate with. Because remember, they're very rational when it comes to love and relationships, so they know how to control men. So how nice would that be? Think about that. If you were able to say anything you want, and then you could use the, oh, <laughs> well, I'm emotional or, well, it's, it's that time of the month or I'm hormonal. So you just have to, whatever. Girls say that all the time. They excuse their own behavior because they can say, well, I'm emotional. Oh, I was caught in my emotions. All right, guys. And we believe them because we know that women operate very emotionally and feelings based with a lot of things. But you better bet she knows this game. Women, psychological ninja, absolutely. This is men, we were born with um, strength, right? We were born with being more muscular than women. Women were born with this little psychological ninja. They're able to play these psychological games. And if we don't understand it as men, uh, it can be devastating. And I'm sure you guys all know uh, guys that have <sighs> been confused by women and never been the same since. Okay, so here's the number one rule, all right? Here's the number one rule. Never believe what a woman says. Okay, you gotta understand, you gotta stick to this. Knowing what we just know, you have to stick to this or you'll be burned. Never believe what she says, always believe how she behaves. You know that whole hashtag believe all women with the whole me too thing? Now, every, every um, healthy human being that I know can agree that uh, you know, like the rape and all that stuff is horrible. That should never happen. But to believe all women is insane because what we just saw with this game, women and women are smart about this. Again, when I say that, I give them a lot of credit. They're psychological ninjas. They're smart. They know how to get under your skin. They know what to say. They know how to mix up their words. They know how to try to confuse you. They know how to Try to, and then if you call them out, you guys know this is why you don't argue with women. There's no point. It's because even if you're winning an argument, what does she do? She can go cry. <laughs> she can do that. You're making me feel bad. You're hurting my feelings. No matter what, she has an out. And so this is what us guys got to understand and have a thick skin, a thick armor, because women are much smarter and calculated, calculated than we give them credit for. Always believe how she behaves. Here, um, and just as a side example, this would be like if a girl said, oh, I, I really like you type thing. Oh, you're, you're so great. She could have said that to you a week ago. And it's like, okay, if she's not texting you back, asking you to do this, asking you that, and like making all these other signs that she likes you, what her words meant nothing. Remember, the words, the, the context is everything with women. The actual words, the content, oh, I like you is not really what it means. In a very, um, another rational way to look at this is when a woman says, I love you, she really means I love what you are doing for my life right now. That's what she really means. It's opportunistic. Again, you can't call women out about this because they will not, it, this is the game that women expect guys to know and they will not explain this game to you. They will not try to help you through it. You just got to know it. All right, so here's the, here's another like difference. Said versus unsaid. Men naturally focus on what is said. 
we're straightforward and try to get right to the most logical point without dancing around. Women naturally focus on what is not said. They read between the lines and pick up on what was unsaid rather than just what was said. Um, uh, side example, do you guys know mirror texting? Principle two, mirror texting. Why do I ne Why do I not talk about lines to send women? I, I literally, I don't give guys lines. To send. I say, hey guys, look at all my texts, send whatever line you want. But I don't give lines out because again, content, us guys, we want a line. Content doesn't matter to women, it's context. So mirror texting, how long is she taking to respond to you? How much energy is she putting? How many questions is she asking you? You take all of these pieces into account, the context, you figure out how much a girl likes you. If you just are expecting to just look for the content of what she's saying, oh, oh, she complimented me, I think she likes me, you're gonna lose. That's where um, women are so far ahead of the game. They know that they can, they know that they can play um, whatever game they want because all they have to do is feed these little things to guys to keep them strung along. They just give these little pieces of content. Oh, you're so great, all that. And then that guy stays in her orbit, her rotation, and now she's like, um, you know, when, she, when she's hungry for a free meal, that's a guy that she can call. She just gives this, these guys these little pieces to hang on, these content. But if these guys are were taken into the whole context of how she's actually behaving, they would know she's not interested. Don't forget, subscribe, like, comment, share the video, but definitely subscribe. Peace.